Here are four numbers of the most successful dance studio business owners keep track of every single month. Number one, total enrollments. Why this number instead of active students? Total enrollments gives you the full picture. You may have 100 active students, but your total enrollments are going to usually amount to much more than that. Knowing this number every single month will help you understand how your overall monthly tuition is growing, and it's going to help you understand are you effectively getting more students to take more classes. Number two is new student registrations. Knowing this number will indicate how well your marketing is working to bring in new families and how well you and your team is effectively converting leads and trials into registrations. Number three is cancellations, arguably the most important number on my list. Reason being is retention is one of the most critical aspects of maintaining a thriving business year over year. Doesn't matter how many new students you're putting in at the top, if you're losing just as many on the bottom, Keeping track of your cancellations month over month is going to illuminate some areas where you may be able to improve retention and keep your students longer. It will also indicate what times of years you're most likely to lose students, maybe if it's after a holiday show or right when you post recital fees. Knowing this in advance will help you prepare for the next year on what you can do to proactively address your retention issues. And number four is your monthly revenue tuition. Knowing your revenue will ultimately let you know on how well your business is growing month after month but it's also gonna highlight where you may be losing out on revenue from delinquent payments from customers who have been coming to dance classes but are paying their fees late. So while this list only had four, these are not the only numbers you should be paying attention to, but these four are very important to know the health of your business on a month-to-month -month basis. Without knowing these numbers, you have no idea if you are a sinking ship, you're going nowhere, or you're on your way to growth. For more dance studio growth tips like this, give us a follow and go ahead and send this to a dance studio owner who may need to hear this.